Hey, 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 YouTube! First of all, come back to Galactic Gaming! Bop, 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 this is Hatfield15 reporting for duty, and we're back with Sue Per Mario Maker! Hey guys, we're back with some more Super Mario Maker, and now, this is episode 92, you guys. Eight episodes remaining of this long series. If you guys have. Oh, I got new notifications, okay. <laughs> New world record on Alice practice. Eh, I don't care. I'm gonna keep making the video. But anyways, again, if you guys have suggestions for what you guys want to see for the final episode of Mario Maker, let me know in the comments below. So just before we begin, you guys, can this video please hit 15 likes? And if you're watching this and you're not subscribed, please be sure to smash the subscribe button if you want a shout out. Be sure to show your subscription to me publicly if you want to make sure you got a shout out. So without further said, for all systems, go for this video in three. Two, one, here we go. So if you guys haven't heard the news yet, if you're all big fans of Marvel, I just found out yesterday that something very, very sad happened in the Marvel Universe. Um, Stan Lee, the, basically the creator of guys like Iron Man, Black Panther, basically all my, fa all, everybody's favorites uh, Marvel characters, and apparently the X-Men had passed away at the age of 95. And of course, being a Marvel fan myself, I'm actually very... Very saddened by the death of Stanley. I mean, he lived till he was like 95 years old, so I'm not gonna lie, he lived pretty long for a guy like him. I thought he would be in his like his 80s or something, but nevertheless, again, it's really still it's still very sad to see uh, Stan pass on um, and cross the Rainbow Bridge. But again, he made some pretty damn awesome stuff, and apparently, I found out that he was uh, a telecoms repairman in the. U.S. Army, so, yeah, the more you know, I did not know that Stan had partly served in the U.S. Army during the Second World War, but, ah, again, he's, I guess he's more so known for creating such iconic characters like Iron Man, Captain America, that I could just go on and on. Okay, wait, I, now I've gotta just run him. Oh, yeah, oh, you just gotta, you just gotta run him and gun him. Oh, but, nope, you thought... Oh, oh crap. Well, I thought, okay, you know what? Third time's the charm. We're gonna get it this time. I just gotta make sure to not lose my mushroom at the fourth one. That's just what I've gotta do here. But again, getting back on topic to Stan Lee, it's, it's still very heartbreaking to see him go. So I guess Marvel movies really just aren't gonna be the same uh, without him. None of these crossed the rainbow bridge and uh, joined other legends in heaven. Okay, can I just. Uh, it's okay. It's alright, it's okay, I'm cool. St but nevertheless, again, the message is still kind of the same. Rest in peace, Stan Lee. You'll never be forgotten. I was I was tempted to make a little SFM poster of uh, certain Marvel characters like Spidey and Tony Stark at, like, uh, at his grave or whatever. So, but yeah, uh, SFM on my new computer is acting a little wonky, so that's a bit of a lost dream there. But, uh, okay, crap. I, I had something in mind I wanted to say, but I forgot about it already. But... Oh yeah, I mean, if in, in, until I remember, this might have been it, but uh, make sure you guys, uh, I, don't forget, I'm also doing a live stream this Saturday just to test out my live streaming equipment, so make sure you guys ring and ding that notification bell so you don't miss out on that test live stream in any future videos, because hopefully if this goes well, that this test live stream is going to be a real banger. I'm probably going to play Metroid Zero Mission, and if that stream goes well, I might as well play Fortnite, since a lot of people do Fortnite streams nowadays. And I lost Yoshi, so he was probably important, so I'm gonna skip on that level. I'm, uh, yeah, it's not worth it now that I've lost Yoshi. Super Mario Red Coins RPG 3YMM. Okay, let's see. Oh, it's clearly involving uh, red coins, so I, apparently I've gotta collect those. Wait a minute. Okay, so this isn't. I like that music. I absolutely that music is absolutely awesome. I love it. Now can I is can I go down this pipe? I cannot go down this pipe. So come on, where is that? Hmm. Not gonna lie, I definitely like that music. That is that is definitely one thing to like about this level, even though it's a little ear piercing. Okay, found the I found the first red coin. So the question is, how do I get to it? Uh, clearly there must be something to do with pipes, so, um, okay, wait, there's this red par Paracoopa Troopa, so I wonder if maybe he's got something to do with it. Like, I've never really known how to actually 
make a Mario Maker level so that it actually plays music like so. So I mean, if I if I only I had ever figured out how to do that, but I guess I'm not really making levels on Mario Maker anymore. I'm just playing them and getting frustrated for your personal entertainment. All right, come on, let's see. Can we find? Maybe there's another red coin we can find in the meantime whilst we're just screwing around doing our business. All right, that bomb. There's a bomb up right there. So wait a minute. Not sure if these note blocks. I'm not sure if that one note block has something to do with it, but I have a suspicious feeling it does have something to do with it. All right. Yep. Didn't think so. I just wanted to test it for the sake of testing. All right. The music's starting to get a little annoying, but hmm. Okay. Maybe we're supposed to go down this pipe. Um. Okay. I mean. Okay. Oh, there's the key door. The. Key. Oh. Okay. That just starts it all over again. Okay. Hmm. Eh, it's all right. Tough Castle Number One by Ben. Okay, Ben. Let's see. Uh, let's see, just see how tough this castle possibly can be. Okay, not so tough. Dodging those Wigglers was pretty easy, even though I just triggered one. All right, I didn't get that high of a jump, so you know what? I'm just gonna not uh, hesitate for anything, and I'm just gonna make a Mario-styled run for it. Oh, okay, I went down the pipe. Aha! I made a good decision going for the pipe. Can I go back up? Uh-oh. Well, that was a bit of a predicament. But maybe I can go back down the pipe. Like, maybe it'll reset. Did it reset? Okay, no, it didn't reset. Doggone it. All right, looks like I'm gonna have to sacrifice my mushroom to get out while I still can. Oh, that just... It just brought me right around. Okay, that was... That escapade was all for nothing. And then again, I'm used to doing stuff all for nothing. I've done it plenty of times throughout my, uh, probably, I think it's been two and a half years since I started up my channel. So yeah, about, I've been, I'm used to doing stuff on my, for nothing on, in the two years of this channel's life. And whiskey. Okay. All right. It was a P-switch. Not sure what else it would have been. Hmm. I feel like there's some kind of... No, I feel like there's some kind of P door I'm missing, so. Oh, 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 oh. Oh! Ooh! Oh, come on! I was right there. That's a load of baloney. That is a bunch of hooey. Alright, but I know that there's a fire flower down here, so. All I need to do is simply jump down, jump back up after the fire flower, and now I can just go about my casual old day. Okay, just about fell into the lava right there. Oh, whoa. Uh, uh, okay, I lost it anyways. That was all for nothing. Again, used to saying it was all for nothing. Now, uh, I got a P-switch, and I've got to make a run for it. Okay, crap, lost my thing, but now I've got my thing back, and I immediately lose it again. Oh, oh, boy, that was some sick plays right there. You thought, Bowser, you thought. Okay, I only got one life, so you know what? I guess that was all for something right here. Eh, no matter how small, I guess it is all for something in the end. Yeah, and in my opinion, it just really... Doesn't matter, 92 episodes of this crap, and yet nothing really seems to change. Oh, hey, I got a new record. Yay, uh, woo! Thank you very much for Tough Castle number one, Ben. It took me a couple tries, but I wouldn't say it was too tough. Either I'm not getting hard enough levels, or I've just become an actually somewhat good player at this game. It took me long enough, though. Then again, it might just be the whole easy level thing, because I'm a coward. Oh. Oh, you know what I should have done? I should have just... I should have actually just waited for those things to, um, oh great, brain fart, uh, that's the second brain fart in this video, gosh darn it, okay, alright, so maybe, alright, maybe that was what I was supposed to do, I felt like there was something else I was supposed to do, but, you know, it doesn't really seem that way in the end, really, uh, come on, okay, I thought there would have been something up here, but doesn't look like it, hmm, not sure why you have the POW blocks, but we're just gonna grab them coins. Uh, boing. He doink. Boink. Not sure why you have a majority of this stuff, even if it's all for nothing. Alright, the end was right there, so I assume I've got to do some kind of leap of faith. That's, yeah, that is likely, that is the most likely thing I've got to do in this little thing. Oh, okay, I thought I could, I thought I could actually just jump the whole thing, but, you know, apparently it doesn't really seem like that's the case we just gotta hit that p-switch 
grab them coins, and now we just wait for the coins to revert to blocks before we jump back on top of them, slide down into them DMs like, what up, babe? <laughs> yeah, you think you, you, I still think like sliding into your DMs joke is still like a funny joke, but in my opinion, it's really not that funny when I say it. Okay, I got another life, so that's good. Now with the leap of faith! Oh boy! That leap of faith never failed me. Hmm. You thought I was gonna hit that other spring there, didn't you? But no, I am not going into the abyss today, good sir. I'm going into the castle and onto saving Peach's arse for probably like the 400th time. I, it's amazing to see that Mario's been in like over 300 games, if my knowledge is correct, from watching Death Battle. It is just really impressive to see a character that iconic. I mean, if I mean, sure, so, there are other video game characters out there that are extremely iconic, like Pikachu, Master Chief, but. And generally, we can all just kind of agree that the most iconic video game character in history is, without a doubt, uh, this red mustache guy that we're playing as. I mean, I don't know, I don't think anybody knows what the video game industry would have been like without Mario. I mean, of course, it's likely that we wouldn't have awesome games like Smash Bros. Ultimate. I mean, we might have had games like Smash Bros. It just wouldn't have Mario and Luigi and other Mario-related characters in it. But still, again, the video game industry really all kind of got started by Mario's creation. And of course, it just went on and on and on until we reached something like this. Okay, I felt like we would have to go in that pipe for a moment, but you know, it doesn't really look like that's the case now. Whoop, ba ba da ba ba Again, it's just those sound effects that never seem to get old, no matter how many times you uh, hear them, and even if it starts to get a little annoying. Alright, I got a mushroom, but you know what? I'll still take the mushroom just in them points. Okay, wanted to shoot that. Like, wouldn't you... I feel like we should get, like, a bonus or, like, a point or something. I mean, we're not really doing anything to force these guys into the abyss there. They're mainly just falling into the abyss on their own accord right here. I mean, they're not really doing anything to kind of purposely fall into the abyss, but yeah, I mean, the reason I'm saying that whole thing is because in Metroid Prime 3 Corruption, I guess there's a thing on Elysia where you, I guess you could destroy a bridge while a couple of steam bots are still on it, and then you get like a friend voucher for a stylish kill. I'm, I feel like there'd be multiple scenarios where you get a stylish kill in Prime 3, but I only know of the one, so uh, what do I know? I'm just a uh, dummy by this point in time. Okay, thank you for that level, uh, Zymos? Fall, I don't know, I don't know. Zymos, thank you very much for uh, falling down. Okay, level 16. Once again, we're at that make or break point, ladies and gents. So, let's see. Let's see if we can end off this video on a good run here. Hopefully without dying 38 more times. So. Okay, it's already one of these levels where we're just phasing through the thing. Okay, I have the feeling, yeah, there's a P, yeah, there's a, P, there should be a P switch somewhere around here. I feel like there must be... Oh, good lord, that is a lot of prop shrooms, and I don't know why you're just baiting me. That's just a waste. Uh, okay, let's just take this one small step at a time like Neil Armstrong. Whoop. Woo! Alright, we got a fire flower. Now... Uh, come on. I think that was... God, it's a, you know what? I should have skipped that level because you know what? That was actually far too easy. All right, we shouldn't have the power up there to begin with. Okay, crap. Oh no, the blocks are blocking my way, so I got to get them to Princess the Peach. Uh, nah, that level was far too easy in my opinion. So I'm gonna do a couple more levels of a new one before I actually end off the video because that was far too easy. That was. I knew, I, I felt like I should have skipped that level, but you know what? I'm just, of course, it's just me looking for. An easy route around. Hey, Peach, uh, <laughs> millionth time we've done this already, but yeah, 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 I know. Obviously, we're your hero, and again, I don't know why it is that Peach can't really defend herself in the Mario games, but yeah, in games like Super Smash Bros., uh, she, can e she can fight people off with her booty. I mean, that's just... Uh, I'm already. I already remember that one episode of Smash 4 I did where I was fighting Sonic, playing as Princess Peach, and I just did a whole suicide bomber thing. And then of course there's my my joke of uh, like there being titanium parts hidden in her dress, like titanium hip implants, because there is no way the average person's hip would do that much damage to a said person. But eh, it's video game logic versus real life logic. Now let's see what we've got here. Oh, okay, we've got Cap'n. 
Again, I remember that originally the series all started with me just trying to get the Zero Suit Samus Mystery Mushroom after like three runs before I would end off the series, but look at us now, like not episode 92 and we're closing in on the 100th and final episode. Again, like, it would, wouldn't it kill Peach? Like, wouldn't it really um, hurt Peach's budget that much to armor, toad gu armor toads with like good old assault rifles or whatever? Because whatever Peach's method of uh, home security is, it's really not working out. I just kind of got forced into that, so of course I wasn't expecting... I mean, of course I can't make that jump, I'm just not prone enough. Okay, I can only make out a surprise face and an, oh, uh, a cute face, or a woo face. I'm not sure how you would pronounce that in English, but... Oh, good lordy mighty. Oh my god, this is this, this is an insane... That opti This optical illusion is like insane. I think I can just botch the system, though, because... Wait a minute. Why do I feel like this is a trap? Yep, that was a trap. I don't know. I, I don't know what I was thinking. I just wanted to poke at it, nevertheless, and just see what happened. But you know, as they say, curiosity killed the cat. Speed run by Zarakon or Zarakon, however you would pronounce it. Okay, not so bad of a speed run. Thinking I can make it. Oh 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 oh. Whoa. Oh, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna make it, guys. I'm gonna freaking make it! Up, oh. Ah, uh, bung, hey, doing. Ow, right to the face. But you know what? I can make it. I'm gonna make it. That The end was right there. I'm, I'm, this might be the first speedrun level I actually complete and uh, not give up on. Oh, 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 oh! Ah, crap. I don't know how I did it the first time. Ah, nevertheless, it doesn't really matter because third time is the charm. We're gonna get it this time. Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go. Okay, the major obstacle, uh, like the biggest obstacle is uh, passed. And then I kill myself for my own stupidity. Ah, you know what? I get, not giving up. Not giving up, nevertheless. It doesn't matter how many, time I, how many times I fail this level. I am simply not giving up on the dream of beating this level. Oh! No. No! Come on! Uh, uh, defeat. I just had to wall jump off of that one edge. Okay. I'm so close. I'm I'm just so close to actually beating that. I, I'm just... I am just inch... I was just literally... I am not even exaggerating. I was just inches away from beating that thing up. Boing! You know what? Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. I might. I'll. I'll. I'll waste all 100 lives on this if I have to. <sighs> it's okay. It's okay. The good thing is the auto scroll stops it. Like, <sighs> screw it. Just screw it. Uh, come on. What? Even when I when I'm so close, I always just end up failing. But you know what? That's just me. That's just your boy Hadfield 15 uh, doing what he does best. Okay, thankfully there's no auto scroll in this one, and I've got a mushroom, so... Oh! Oh, oh I should've... I, I should've twirl jumped on him. Oh! You think you slick, huh, Spikes? Okay, he thinks he's slick, and I just think I'm even slicker, but I... Okay, I'm gonna remember... I've gotta remember that there's the thwomp at, like, that third platform right there. Yes, there we go. We actually, uh, I actually remembered to spin jump this time. Up, uh, up, uh, no! Oh, I can make it, I'm gonna 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 make it. Not gonna make it. Okay, one more try of this level. Let's just give it one more go, because I feel like had I not gotten cocky with that last part, I think I could have potentially made it. A doink, he doink, a boink. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, oh, let's go, oh yeah, Woo Now there's all these pipes here, I knew it, I knew you couldn't trust, I knew you couldn't trust a pipe for a second, and I don't know why I just threw something at it, okay, well, it's evident this is probably gonna take quite a while, but, you know what, infinite one-ups, I can't really be too mad at that fact, Ah, uh, you know what, the level's complete nevertheless, cause that's been revealed, and I got not three of my, like, ten lives so far back, nah, again, it really doesn't, really doesn't appeal to me whether we succeed or not, 
in these last runs as opposed to when I first began this series. Especially doesn't matter what I think about levels like Companion Spring. I mean, at least I got past the first Companion Spring level. It was just the second one that just... Oh my god, I try to play levels like, I try to play levels that Markiplier raged on thinking I could beat them, but yet I end up in the same state as him, and probably Aaron and Ross from when they played it, uh, no, not Aaron and Ross, Ross made, I, I believe it was Ross from the Game Grumps that made, uh, that made the Companion Spring levels, yeah, I was thinking of, uh, I meant to say, I, I meant to say like Dan, like, yeah, Aaron and Dan, when they played those levels, they were in the same state as I was. Any more magic Koopas? Oh, it, it was just a few coins in the end. It was all for just a bunch of coins. Uh, okay, cat paws kind of startled me. No. I hate my life. Oh, 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 nope. Not today. Not tonight. Not sure if there was going to be a pipe that dispenses, that dispenses Goombas, but... Huh. Standing right on the edge of glory right here, or in my case the edge of death, but you know what we can run Oh, boing Hey doink Woo! Oh, I made it. Okay. I feel like I was gonna make it. I was not I was not pessimistic one Little bit right there was I now nope. No, no absolutely no pessimism whatsoever hell ever Okay, you know what actually one more level wouldn't be Really would not be the worst thing in the world if I just did one more level for you all. Really, again, it just really would not be the worst thing in the world. Easy slips. Uh, thank you very much for easy slip. Easy slips. X. It's a chayum. I. God, there are just some names in this world that my mind are just not meant to correctly pronounce. It's just one of those things that just pronunciation is so far beyond my mind. Okay. Oh. I don't know what pipe they expect me to go up for a moment. Up. Oh. oh. Alright, we're just gonna run along the thwomps. Oh, wait a minute. It's a series. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I see how it works. I see. There was It was a multiple choice thing. Wrench Brigade by Dominic. Okay, let's see what you've brought me today, Dominic. Okay, just a nice little airship level. Oh, Wrench Brigade. Okay, it's probably gonna have like a crap load of these dudes. I mean, I know that the alternative form of those are like where they burst out of the ground and just run blindly towards you are Monty Moles, but I don't know uh, what these what these like Wrench Thrower guys actually are called. If you guys actually know what these guys are called, please let me know in the comments down below because I would really personally like to know. I also personally like to know why I suck so much at some of these levels. Oh, okay, that was close to hitting me. That was just a mere set. That was a that was not even a centimeter away from the top of my head. Oh, oh, okay. I could have made it under. Nevertheless, it doesn't matter how close um, it was to the ground. I, I just made it past it easy peasily. Okay, now I see the next uh, jump. Up, uh, boink. Be gone. Up. Oh. Okay, okay, crap, this, these are becoming, this is starting to become far too many wrenches for my lichen, lichen-ness. Up, up, boink, oh, oh, okay, oh, no, 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 oh, so close. Okay, let's try one more level, then I'm gonna end off the video. Let's just hope it's less uh, intricate than that one. Well, actually, I like intricacy in... Mario Maker levels. Otherwise, it's just too easy like the 16th level we just did in this episode. Okay. Alright. Oh! I was given the impression I was supposed to... I mean, I don't know. I, I just always wall slide. I just always uh, slide against the walls for safety because if there's some kind of hazard I'm previously unaware of, I just need... I feel the need to just get the heck out of there while I, as fast as I possibly can. Okay, well, I'm probably going to go ahead and end off the video here, you guys. Again, make sure you guys let me know what you guys want to see for the final episode of Super Mario Maker when it comes about, likely in the early 2019. And let's not forget, I also have a live stream likely starting this Saturday at about uh, 12 p.m. I'll be starting a live stream. So make sure you guys ring and ding that notification bell so you don't miss out on the stream. So for now, that's about the time we've got today. So thank you all for joining me today. Be sure to subscribe. Leave comments down below because I like them and crank that like button to the max like Soldier Boy. Till then, I'm Hatfield15.
Space Opera's and Rosita's.